up to now we have discussed about the fluids which are at rest from now we are going to discuss about the fluids which are at motion so the first concept in this fluids motion is streamline motion or steady motion or streamline flow or steady flow what is this meaning of streamline streamline is nothing but a, a simple straight line but streamline means it is a combination of many straight lines not only a single straight line how it is possible in the case of fluids motion let us take a tube of finite cross section finite length and finite width so length comma width third one is area of cross section these three are the main important dimensions for a tube now some amount of water is flowing through this tube from one end to the another end with some velocity like this whenever some amount of fluid nothing but the water which is moving from one end of the tube to the another end of the tube try to pick three points in its path let us say this point is a this point is b and this point is c a b c are the three reference points at these three points the velocity of this fluid is respectively v a and v b and v c if it is a streamline flow the velocity of this fluid doesn't change with time and doesn't change with direction also if suppose if the tube is in the curved shape like this suppose if we assume the streamline flow is also in the curved shape like this the dotted lines indicates the flow of the water so this is position a this is position b and again this is position c these three points are not in the collinear path they are at different angles separated so the velocities of this fluid elements at a b c are v a v b v c respectively so in these two examples what we can understand is the velocity of a given fluid element is not changing with respect to time and directions at any point throughout its path the velocity of the fluid element is same and constant then this flow is said to be streamline flow or steady flow the velocity of a chosen fluid element is not changing with time and direction with time and direction and maintaining the constant velocity at each and every point throughout its path throughout its path then it is called streamline flow or steady flow line flow or steady flow the properties of streamline flow is properties of 
streamline flow the lines of streamline flow doesn't intersect with each other that is the first property the lines of streamline flow doesn't intersect with each other second one the streamlines are crowded when the velocity is more the streamlines will be crowded be crowded when the velocity is more the tangent drawn to the points is always gives the direction of the flow of the fluid element the tangent drawn to the fluid elements is always gives the direction of flow of fluid element third points free body dynamics is like this this is the tube of a finite curved shape so this is the fluid which is moving from one point to another point so these are the points in the flow a b and c from each point we can draw the tangents like this each tangent explains about the direction of the flow of fluid element and sometimes it explains the direction of the velocity of the fluid elements also if you like this video please give a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on cbse syllabus